Hi everyone, it is A19 here in the Dominican Republic and we are on August 10th. I am going to try to make this version of the the salvation comes from Christ. The salvation comes from Jesus Christ. But but before this, I I just want to tell you that it's amazing that I was thinking on this while I was working. Sorry. Sorry, while while I was walking, for looking to uh, a little bit a little bit of um, corn flak corn flakes. <laughs> I don't know how to say it correctly, but I was about to buy something of food and some of food and and in the in the way I saw a girl and she stopped my way I mean my steps and she told me what is your name and I said my name is Reynold why did you ask and she said I don't know and then I asked her what is your name and she said and she she said Gabriela and I and I was like okay interesting that's a that's a good name take care bye bye And then I continued walking and I stopped in a little, 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 um, small uh, shopping uh, of shop. How can I say that? A little, little, small shop uh, place. And in there, I could buy the, set, the cereal that I wanted. The corn flakes that I wanted, and in there especially, there was a girl called Adriana, but she has 15 years old, and she always talks to me like, like just like friends, something randomly, and I was showing her like my video when I was um, shooting some throws in the in the basket today in the up uh, in the morning so now i am going to read the bible with you and we are gonna do it in english that's the best part i have a lot of time without speaking in english but i will do my best because i know that jesus wants me to do it And we are going to do it with the same chapter that we read in, in Spanish. So let me look for the version in English here in the cell phone. I am doing just right now that. And let me see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh -huh, I want to change it. And let's see. Okay, it's still not changing it. I don't know why. Maybe because I have to to choose one of the versions. I changed the the I changed the the idiom. Now I have to choose the version, and uh, and I am going to choose the version that was the favorite one from LNG White. And it is the King James version. Now this is asking me for for logging in, and I am going to logging in with Facebook. And let me see if if it allows me to do it. Um, no, I'm going to go. I'm going to click on continue. Let me see. And that's it. Okay. Perfect. Now I'm going to change the idiom again, and I am going to change the version. And it still is in English. It's in Spanish. I don't know why. Ah, it's because it's downloading. Perfect. It changed. Perfect. Now we are going to be able to read in English. You know, sometimes people 
um, need to see the miracles so the people can believe. That was something that Jesus told to a uh, father that was desperate because of his his um, son, I think that it was. He said, if you don't see miracles, you don't believe. And and you know something, when I read that, I I I felt a little, 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 little bit. <laughs> um, how can I say that? Um, sad. I I I felt sad because I said, "Wow, is that true? Is that true?" Because today we we cannot see miracles every day, and how will how then? Is going to be our faith growing? I mean, how are gonna be uh, our faith uh, still and be sure in Christ? How can ensure myself? How can I ensure myself in Christ if I don't see a miracle? I don't know if you are understanding. Well, the people that know English, knows English, will say, Reino, your English is not bad, but not as good as it would be. And I know that. The best part is that I have like years without speaking English and I know that when I continue doing this, you will get surprised. But that's something that is not, uh, that is not um, for, 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 me to, for me to have on mine or, or to be... Um, Um, preoccupation, you know, that's something that is not, that is not uh, too sad, too difficult to confront. Uh, something also, also something interesting is that a, a dog decided to follow me all the way back to my house, and I wasn't looking at him. I, I didn't notice that he was behind me but the dogs that are here close to my house casually they were near and when they saw that I was coming and that other dog that was from another sea, from another place they started to 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 um to back to drag, to back at, at him and they started to back really really um loudly and they even run <laughs> to him in in uh, in as a team you know and i was like wow i am protected by these dogs <laughs> For real, it was really, really, really weird. And there is a boy here that is like the the devil seeker. He walks like if he was a serpent, and he is always appearing, always in the times that I am walking to a place. He appears like if he doesn't has a place for. To, to see or to go or to look at but he is just working you know for the devil and I know that and that's why that every time that I see him I cl I, I close my my arms in sign of if you come to me I am going to punch you on your face so that <laughs> That's okay. Let's let's um, go to the read of today. 
Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, thank you for everything that you give us. Please keep protecting us, maybe with the nature and the animals, but more of that with your angels and with your wisdom and with your power that is that is in, unmeasurable and and that is amazing. Please, Lord, um, give me more uh, fluent, fluently to read these um, chapters that I'm going to do uh, frequently from now on. And I am doing this for you. You know that. Please calm our hearts and help us to be patient for so that we could um, receive your promises your promises are like gold that is refined on fire so it is worth it to continue and to persevere on your faith we we don't have to to blame anyone or to to try to to guilt anyone for something that maybe is not even necessary to think about we just need to look at you and continue forward so in the name of Jesus in in your name we wait in your name we trust Amen. Ok, miren, aquí vienen unos muchachos, así que yo voy a entrar a mi cuarto para que no se escuche tanto. Ups, sorry, I was speaking in English and I didn't... Sorry, I was speaking in Spanish and I didn't even notice. Uh, what I was saying that... That I was... What I was saying was that... Uh, apparently, some guys were about to come... And and they are just making noise. So I am going to close the door of my house and I am going to get into my house because I am out of it. Okay. I'm here. Let's it start. The Lord reigneth. Let the earth rejoice. Let the multiple the multitude of idols be glad thereof. Clouds and darkness are round about him. Righteousness and judgment are the habitation of his throne a fire goeth before him and burneth up his enemies around his enemies round about his lightnings his lightnings enlightened the world the earth saw and trembled the hills melted like wax at the presence of the Lord, at the presence of the Lord of the whole earth, the heavens declare his righteousness, and all the people see his glory. Confounded be all they that serve graven images that boast themselves of idols worship him all you gods Zion heard and was glad and the daughters of Judah rejoiced because of the judgments O Lord for thou Lord art high above all the earth thou art exalted for above all gods you 
Give that Lord. Per, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Give that love the Lord. Hate evil. Evil. Sorry. He preserve. He preserve. He preserveth the souls of his saints. He delivereth them out of the hands of the wicked. Meaning, I am going to make a pause and I am going to speak in, in Spanish. So, for the people that listen to this in Spanish, could know what is wicked and what is that he preserveth his souls from the wicked that is something very important and I know and I want my people to know that ok la gente que me escuchen en español yo quiero que sepan que en inglés dice aquí la, en el versículo 10 el persevera el alma de sus santos los lleva en la mano fuera de el impío o fuera de el wicked también, en cierto modo, da la impresión, sensación, sentimiento de impío, pero cuando es un impío poseído. O sea, es una persona que está eh, prácticamente que trabaja para el diablo. <risas> Disculpen que suene tan feo. Ahora voy a cambiar a inglés, está bien. So, now I am switching to English. Let's continue. I am going to repeat now the verse 10. So for you to continue with a flowing and a soft way, uh, this reading. Ye that love the Lord hate evil, hate evil, sorry. He preserveth the souls of his saints. He delivereth them out of the hand of the wicked. Light is sound for the righteous, and gladness for the upright in heart. Rejoice in the Lord, you ye righteous, and give thanks at the remembrance of His holiness. Ok, honestamente, oh, ok, sorry, <laughs> sometimes, I, sometimes I, use, I speak in Spanish because I forget that I am talking in English, but what I was about to say is that honestly I feel that I read it um, more or less, I mean I was kind of good and I hope with all my heart that you read it you personally I mean you with me but you personally because if you do so you will be better granted better beneficiated and that's my goal that we get beneficiated with the world of our God and also who knows maybe God will send a, a team of ducks to defend you again <laughs> against others just like if just like as he did with me few minutes ago and let me see um what verses i could say that are the ver are the best um a fire goeth before him, and burneth up his enemies round him, round about. His line is lightnings, enlightens the world, the earth, soul, and trembleth. Uh, I don't know if you know that in one of my uh, um, other audios <laughs> or podcast or or, or voice, no, voice notes <laughs> I said that um, the, the earth takes form while the, the light is closing I mean 
is getting closer to it. And that's why David said that in the verse 4. It says, it says, His lightings enlightened the world. The earth saw and trembled. You see, why trembled? Because his lights. And let me go to the verse 8. Zion heard and was glad. And the daughters of Judah rejoiced because of thy judgment, O Lord. And in other words, we can be sure with God because he is a good judge. He's not like the parable of the of the bite of the bad judge <laughs> that the that the um, woman had to go um, repeatedly. <laughs> repeatedly, <laughs> uh, I mean, um, more than twice or three times to the judge say in his mind okay this woman is just bothering me I don't I don't believe in God and I don't I don't ha I am not afraid of any man but just for this woman not to keep coming to here I am going to make justice to him <laughs> but God is not like that. And well, this is the the reading of today. And uh, let's let's finish with the verse eleven and twelve. And they say, "Light is sound for the righteous." In other words, the righteous has lights in his light in himself and gladness for the upright in heart gladness means like um honor in my in my opinion i am not completely sure i will look for it just right before we finish this reading and rejoice in the lord you Righteous, and give thanks at the remembrance of remembrance of His holiness. We know what holiness means. Holiness is um, like um, pureness. Pure is when some someone is pure, and more than pure is pure, perfect, and holy. <laughs> In other words, is pure, perfect. And is perfect and pure um, with God, and, oh, and 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 usually is uh, eternally pure. And that's why when I say that, when I hear, when I hear that someone say, "I am holy," I I see him and I say, "Wow." Are you sure of what you're saying? <laughs> because no one, the Bible says that no one is going to be is going to be sure until that day. But uh, some people usually say that. But uh, let's let's uh, keep that for another moment. So we are going to to speak about it in another moment and maybe. We even are going to see uh, a study of this in English in my channel. But that's it. Let's pray. I am going to stop the recording. Um, program because in here the praying stops automatically. I don't know why. Maybe because Joseph... <laughs> sold me the cell phone. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry for you, Joseph. But it's true. Your name was Joseph. But... Okay. I hope that everyone can close his eyes. 
right now or their eyes right now so dear father in heaven thank you because we can increase our talents as much as we use it and thank you because of your prophecies that you gave us be between your servant Ellen G. White God I need you and also all the people that are listening to me are needing you please take care of them and save them from everything that may be bad and maybe they are not even noticing about it thank you for everything Lord in you we wait in you we trust amen maybe some people may ask Crino why do you put that image that looks that look um, that look a little bit of weird because of his quality well the reason is that Jesus in that specific moment he usually said that the kingdom of heaven is like a like a, 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 um, a net of fish that you that you throw to the sea or the water and you take all the fishes and you separate the good from the bats and that's exactly what I'm doing right now everything that I do has a purpose and I hope that in your life you always have a purpose too that's something that Jesus teaches to do so bye bye and God bless you